I'm back. <laughs> well, I want to say Happy New Year. It is January 5th. I am here on the porch. It's a gorgeous 65 degrees. You can hear the highway off in the distance. Um, it's just gorgeous. I'm, I ran around and did some things today and I'm happy to report a few progresses and also a few struggles because everyone knows the struggle is real. Can I get a what? <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so I had gone through the Christmas holidays and New Year's and I've actually been out of work for a month and a week now. Uh, so I've had no income and I've had uh, uh, no unemployment. I'm not sure why that's still pending all these five weeks. But it's given me a lot of time to be able to uh, do some things. Um, st I did not exercise at all, really, uh, during the holidays. Um, and here's struggle number one, because <laughs> consistency is key. I wasn't consistent, so I was feeling a little blah. Um, no, I didn't blow it eating-wise, because uh, my stomach won't allow it. I um, did what I was supposed to do food-wise. I mean, yes, I cheated, but even the little bit, couldn't. I just couldn't do much. But uh, I um, didn't exercise at all during the holidays. And uh, starting January 1st, I hit it, started hitting it, doing uh, about up to 30 push-ups a day. Um, jog, walking, a um, couple of laps. I got the jump rope out, so I'll be starting that soon. I got the sun bearing right down on me. I'm so bright you can call me sunny. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so as of right now, I went to the doctors this morning uh, to do my bariatric uh, measurements. Uh, this was a two month uh, reading, and I'm happy to tell you that uh, I've lost. Uh, 80 pounds so far. Struggle number two. Um, I didn't really lose much. I lost a pound or two within the last uh, week and a half or so. And when I had my appointment with my doctor, I was like, what's up with that, doc? And uh, everyone's saying the same thing. The dietitian, the behavioralist, uh, the bariatric nurse, everyone's saying the same thing, that that's normal. You're going to plateau. Once you start hitting the exercise real hard, You'll start shedding again, uh, and um, I'm halfway to where I want to be as far as the, the amount. I got another 80 pounds to lose. Uh, and um, anyway, so the BMI uh, is encouraging. Even though I haven't lo lost much weight in the last week and a half or so, um, I didn't gain any, <laughs> but I didn't lose as much. I did lose uh, in the measurements, and so that's exciting. So I've lost 22 inches overall. I know that sounds great, right? But that's overall. So what the breakdown is, and I'm going to look at my paper to read it to you. Uh, I am, uh, my neck, I lost two inches in my neck. I lost an inch and a half in my left arm and a half an inch, I mean, um, uh, five inches in my chest. Uh, and I can really feel that. I lost six and a half inches in my waist, and I know that because of the way my pants have been feeling and my belt. Um, literally, uh, everything falls off if I don't wear my belt. My belt's on the last hole, and I'm hesitating to buy new clothes because I'm going to lose some more. Um, my hips, I lost five and a half inches, and my left uh, calf, I lost one and a half inches. My um, uh, fat overall, I was uh, 40.5 uh, body fat, uh, and now I'm 36.9. And just to give you an idea of where I need to be, I, I healthy is 23%. So I'm at 36.9, but I started at 40.5. So very encouraging there. Uh, and my uh, BMI grid, uh, I started at 48.2, and I'm now at 42. So she was real excited about that. Um, that's very encouraging. And she said to uh, don't be discouraged because of the plateau. 
and I've talked with other people and the plateau seems to be common uh, and um, but this is really really good news as far as eating is concerned I'm now in what they call stage five no longer have to eat baby food and mush uh, so between now uh, which is month three and month six my diet will consist of two to five ounces of protein in the morning uh, and the afternoon meal and the evening meal and that is a wide variety of proteins from chicken and fish uh, beef um, and all the variations thereof and uh, and then I'm supposed to have one to two ounces of fruit or vegetable leafy greens mostly uh, and um, I had my blood work done recently and uh, my uh, A1C had dropped drastically and which was absolutely amazing and but one of the things they discovered was my iron because I'm not eating a lot of steak uh, my iron was low and I am taking an iron supplement so she doubled up on my iron supplements but she says start eating some leafy greens uh, they're iron enriched uh, and uh, try to put some red meat down here and there uh, and then I have uh, a mid-morning snack which is going to be my protein shake uh, I'm doing in sure actually uh, and then my afternoon uh, snack is supposed to be six ounces of uh, plain yogurt and two ounces of fruit so there you have it that's my meal and I might take a picture here and there of something um, it's really you know my wife makes everything taste good it's been amazing a lot of people are encouraging me saying they can see it in the pictures that I've been taking here and there um, I need to still take 118 uh, grams of protein in uh, daily I'm still doing 100 ounces of water and uh, I'm supposed to be staying away from carbs and peanut butter I didn't realize that about peanut butter I started doing a couple tablespoons of peanut butter here and there because uh, it does have protein in it and um, nope can't be doing it and I started having toast uh, with butter here and there for breakfast but she said uh, back off of that um, for now so I want to do a try and I want to be healthy you know I want to get in shape for that uh, Spartan coming up in the end of October <laughs> so many people are shocked and, and happy for me to be trying to do that um, but there you have it uh, I had to keep reminding myself of my motto I eat to live not live to eat so I'm not going to give you a weigh-in this week because, like I said, I've not lost but a pound and a half. Uh, and um, uh, also, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you this, I was losing some muscle too. So she said uh, start cranking out the exercise, start doing uh, the push-ups and some dumbbells, uh, start getting that uh, the muscle. Uh, I don't want to lose on the muscle there. I want to lose on the fat not on the muscle and so uh, no way in this time no drum roll <laughs> uh, just Tim saying thank you for your encouragement thank you for those who have subscribed those who liked uh, those who clicked that little bell so that way they could be reminded and notified when I put up a video such as this um, I'm trying to get creative along the way uh, so who knows I'm no Hollywood director for sure. That's my son, Josh. <laughs> Anyways, uh, thank you so much. Uh, trust you have a great beginning to your new year, regardless of what's going on in the health front in our country or the political front in our country. You have your life. You have your family. Uh, stay strong and uh, stay healthy. Thank you so much. God bless.